like the woman was seen as second to men and was supposed to stay at home, uh, do the household chores. And then like when these great came, like rugby league came over, that like is seen as a threat to the culture as well. There's always going to be a, like res resistance and um, there was certainly eat for the women's like playing rugby league back at home. Like it's a new thing, it's a new new thing to the culture as well and to Papua New Guinea as well. Women are seen as second to men and like they're supposed to be like staying at home, look after the family and stuff like that and then you know all of a sudden you see women in the field playing rugby league yeah that in itself it's going against the culture and then it even sit right with the like the men folks back home i think for the first the pioneer girls like you could see when they were playing mostly men figures like men folks like just throwing bottles into the stadium where the girls were playing after the game like watching men do that to our girls it was so um not good to watch. Slowly it was changing though. After that win in like 2019, everything changed for us. And we played a test against um, England. We lost the first, the first test, but the second we played in Port Mosby. You could just feel the atmosphere, the crowd was there, everyone was there. And just to get a win in front of like everyone back home, especially men folks as well, watching the game, seeing that, you know, the women can do what men can do even better as well. It was a great feeling and like you could feel that like things were gonna change for the girls. Now you could see that the, you know, the men, they're participating in the girls. You could see them like running water for the girls. And that means a lot. That has never been done before. Things are gradually changing and it's not going to be like what it has been for the last five years. Me being here is a part, like it's a part of that change. It's just going to inspire more and the change is eventually going to come. Rugby league is, um, is seen as the, the national sport back home and it is a nice platform where we can advocate for change and advocate for like gender-based violence and stuff like that is we advocate through rugby league so yeah it's it's been really good that you know me being in the midst of this and me playing my part as a as an ambassador to you know advocate for that changes it's it's amazing <laughs>